parent boy so we're out here at lake cumberland it is below freezing right now air temperature but we're gonna get out here and try to catch some fish just get outside and do something awesome all right guys so this is actually my first time to lake cumberland in kentucky and it's a cold one but my goal today is to get out here it's a new body of water for me but i want to get out here and break this place down and try to figure out if this was a tournament day and i was coming out here blind what exactly i would do and how my day would go so right now it's 7 25 so i'm going to go to my first spot so in coming out here for the first time um, i did do educating you know of myself before i got out here so what i've gone back and done is i'm on some forums um i've gone back and actually watched some of the flw live coverage from some of the events that have been here in the winter time um so i've done my preparation so i'm trying i'm going to try to figure out and see if i can't find these fish i'm really hoping to get on a good smallmouth bite today because little known fact is i've caught a bunch of smallmouth but i've never actually caught smallmouth on a lake um, this water is really eh, we got about 43 degree water temp air temp is like 26 or something so it's pretty cold i'm hoping that the sun gets out later and warms up so during the winter usually like you get a good afternoon bite so i'm really hoping on to capitalize on that afternoon bite but my first priority this morning is finding the fish so let's go find some fish It's ice coming off of my line. It is cold out here. Really hoping the sun comes out and warms us up. There we go. I got thumped. There we go. Ooh, come on. A little spot. A little feisty. Tube jig brings it home for me. Alright. Little spotted bass. You're chunky. Look how chunky that sucker is. Look at the belly. Man, he has been. Look at the sucker. Look at the belly on that sucker right there. Got him hooked right in the corner of the mouth. And that's just that little tube. I, I'm having a little bit of trouble filling the bites just because I'm getting so much ice on my line that it's hard to feel. Sweet. All right, I am going to go ahead and measure this fish just for fun here. It's a chunky spot. So right at... 15 inches so we're gonna go ahead and let him go thanks buddy you really thumped that Whew, it's cold honestly i'm spending a lot of my time fighting my gear because everything's freezing up i've tried fishing with i've got this jig tied on and honestly this seems to be the best thing going for me right now the spinning reel with that braided line that braided line was getting you know it's it's made out of like a, a fiber and it's getting water on it and it was the whole spool of that reel is just a big frozen block and i kept getting a bunch of wind knots in it, it just makes fishing ex extremely hard i did try to fish a glass shad wrap but i just ha didn't have any bites on it i think these fish are just really really sluggish all right guys so i went over this um i'm gonna link a video here at the end on if you look at this gopro here i don't know if you can see it or not but like this thing's frozen it's got the red light on um 
it, these things struggle in extreme temperatures and that's why what i'm filming you on right now is the dji osmo action and if you're wondering why i chose that camera then i will link two videos at the end one why i switched from gopro to the dji osmo and the second one is going to be if you want to buy a dj osmo and set it up exactly like i have it i'm going to link a video to that at the end also um, but guys ultimately today um, i planned this day off i had no clue that it was going to be this cold outside as far as the air temperature goes and it has just been a struggle and as i said before i've just been battling my gear um, battling to stay warm so i think i'm going to call it quits up here on the lake um, I think I might go try to warm up and then go down to the tailwater, but that's going to be a separate video. So if you see that video, maybe watch it. Hopefully I'll be warmed up by then. But all right, guys, so I'm going to go over the lessons I learned today. Um, this is probably the coldest I fished in in a really long time. Um, lesson one is, is when, once it gets below freezing air temperature, it is really a struggle to fight with your gear. Um, to try to keep ice off your guides, to keep ice out of your reel, to keep your braid casting. Um, so I really probably just said, I should have saw the weather this morning and really judged on what time I got down here. Um, but when I looked at the weather, it also said it was supposed to be a high of 43 today and it hasn't even budged at all since I got here. Um, and I've been here like four hours now and caught one fish all right so the second lesson i learned is these freaking gopros that this thing just hates the cold so i've got one of these dji osmos up here that i'm filming you on now and then i've also got one here in the back um, i do like the chesty rig for like you know if i turn like this and cast um, so i just probably just need to end up getting rid of this thing all right, and lesson three is just make sure that you dress warm. I do feel like I did a good job of dressing warm. Um, I do wish I would have brought some hot hands to put on the back of my gloves so that my hands would have stayed a little bit warmer, um, especially being out here in this cold. But um, I did look for fish a little deeper. I wasn't really able to find any big schools of fish or anything. So if I would have found any big schools of fish, I had a drop shot ready. Um, to try to target those deeper fish um, also had like a swim bait ready um, so today the baits that i went through was i used a shad wrap i used a jerk bait i used a finesse jig and then i used a tube and a swim bait and out of all those baits the only thing i caught anything on was a tube so um, as always guys i appreciate you guys watching I'm sorry I didn't catch more fish today, but I always want to be real with you guys and show you like I did struggle today and it is cold and honestly, I'm ready to get in my car and get warmed up. But as always guys, I appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget, get outside, do something awesome and hopefully it's awesomely warm wherever you're at and I'll see you guys in the next video.